Hello YouTube, today I'm going to show you how to SSH stuff to your iPod Touch. So, let me just do this. It has to be jailbroken. Mine is the iPod Touch, it just has the iPhone interface. Uh, so, first we're going to go on to the desktop. And you must download Windscape. So, Windscape right there. Okay, now it's gonna come up as this. Hold on. Take iPod. Well, yeah. What you're gonna do is you're gonna go to Edit. I mean, no. 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 What you're gonna do? Now you're gonna go back. It says hosting. That is your IP address. What you're gonna do is go back to your iPod and go to settings. Then you're going to go to general. Okay. And, oh wait, no, sorry, sorry, no, sorry. No general. You're going to go to Wi Fi. And you're going to go to the one that you're connected to. You're going to need Wi Fi connectivity for this. The one that you're connected to, there's an arrow next to it. So, I can't show you my IP address, but. It's right there. Well, I'm covering it with my finger. And that's how you do it. And that's your IP address. So you type that in. And then username. Here, I'll just type in a random number. Okay, I'm not typing in my nope. Uh, that's just a default. Go ahead, hackers, try to hack it. Default. Okay, so username. Username. You're going to put R O O T. Root. But not capital. R O O T. Root. Okay. Password. You're going to put A L P I N E. That's Alpine. I have no idea what that is. You don't need a private key file. Now what you're going to do, go see this drop down bar right here, connection, and you're going to up this to 60. Click off of it. Okay. Then you're going to come back to assets. Then you're just going to go back to Yes, sessions. You click sessions. Then you're just gonna go to save. And you can make it whatever name you want. So I'm just gonna put iPod. Wait, I'll just put figure out some. Figure out some DC one seven four. Okay. And you just click on it. Then you just go to see how it's got that highlighted. Okay, now what you're going to do, log in. It's going to go right to this. And if you have this problem right here, that's because you have to download Open SSHS or SSH. So now what you have to do on your iPod now. Go to Cydia and download a program in all programs called Open SSH. Also, you're going to need to download DOS Press. I will put that in the description so you can get that. And once you have that, go to DOS, DOS Press, which I have it in my utilities folder. I have it in my utilities folder, so. There it is right there, boss press. That's what it'll look like. And it's going to say analyzing services. Now, SSH, you might want to turn that off. Okay, SSH has to be on. And Wi Fi has to be on. Okay. So now, doing that, now what you need to do is go to this, 
Super awesome good for some fourth dollar. Okay, so I'm not gonna use that one. I'm just gonna use Jake's iPod. So I'm gonna go to login. Might take a second. Either. I'm just going to use Okay. So it does all that, right? I'm covering that with my finger because that's my IP address. Okay. So it's going to downloading all the stuff. And so down here now, password. Once again, we're going to type in Alpine. Alpine. And then you're going to click enter. Okay, I have caps on them. Make sure no caps on. Alpine. Alpine. Enter. Then you're going to get this. This is SSH. Now, if you want to get to your whole route, click that twice. And there you have it. From here, you can get to lockdowns. Uh, you can get to applications. This is all your applications. This is how you add cracked apps to your community. Thing. And that is it. Super awesome three two one seven four. Peace out. Subscribe. Leave comments. Five stars. Rate it. Thanks very much. Goodbye.